Hi everyone, my name is Rizwan Khan. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing great. Today I'm going to share some resume hacks and I will also tell you how I got shortlisted by top tech companies like Paytm, Make My Trip, Cred, Flipkart, Microsoft and honestly list is long enough so let's not go into all of them. I will mainly talk about two things today. First, how I got shortlisted by top tech companies. Second, a lot of resume hacks and tips for you okay so let's begin with the first one most of the time i get calls from recruiters who find my resume on job portals like knockery linkedin and insta hire and there are many other platforms oh, but i personally prefer these three and they have always worked well for me okay and resume tips i will tell you all the resume hacks but before that there are some base basic things which you have to do always right so first thing is you have to keep your profile up to date in all the job portals right all the major job portals you have to log into the pro, uh, like uh, job portals every day so that your profile is stay visible to the recruiter you have to regularly apply to the jobs that match your interest and you have to apply to the jobs that have been recently posted by the recruiters that increases your chances of getting shortlist okay so these four basic things you have to do every time and now let's talk about some hacks okay hi everyone here we are again and i'm sharing my screen so that i can tell you all the resume tips and hacks for first you need to understand few things like what's ats ats is nothing but a software used by the recruiters to score your resume it is called applicant tracking system if your resume is score if your ats score is good then your chances of getting shortlisted will also be good will also be high okay so how to check your ATC score so there are plenty of website and I prefer this resumewater.com and obviously this is not a free website not completely free but it will let you see your score and will also let you see the suggestion but it will not fix your problem okay so you have to log into this website and yeah let's log in let's pick the account okay so after login you have to upload your resume I'm gonna yeah just click on this and pick your resume over here and let's open it okay now it's doing the processing parsing and identifying the core sections okay it's let, let it do the process once it will be completed we can see our score okay now it is done just few moments okay so we have got a score of 79 which is almost 80 and above 80 would be good enough okay and here it is telling you uh, here there are room for improvement so their summary section can be improved there are some incorrect verb tenses that can be improved there are some bullet points that can be improved okay and I have used this website already couple of times so I cannot fix it from here I have option fix but if I click on it it will ask me to upgrade to which I won't do so here what you can do there is there's other option we have we have chat GPT you can simply visit to the chat gp.com and you can upload your resume so upload from the computer what's there fail to get your settings let's refresh yeah it's fine just click on this plus and upload from computer and here is the resume just open your resume and ask the chat so you know there are problems in just click on this home and you can see summary section okay just ask chat okay as per ATS, there, as per ATS, uh, there is some scope for summary section improvement. What you can write whatever you want as long as it, as it makes sense. Okay, just click on submit. Okay, so it's telling you and it's giving you the summary. Just wait for so this is we have got a new summary and what you can do you can simply update your summary section with this new content and then you can upload your resume again and you can see your score again and if it is improved then you can move to another section which is incorrect verb tenses you can same way you can ask the charge video to fix things and you can keep on checking you can keep checking your ATS score if you are satisfied with it then that's it okay so this is how we we uh, improve our resume now how to create the resume okay so there are a lot of online tools to create the resume online free uh, resume builders you can simply type online resume builder and there are a lot of options like uh, uh, here you can see nova resume 
resume.io, enhance, cv. So all of these are good. You can see a lot of templates over here. You can free, you can use those free templates. You can customize it, but there are some limitation. You cannot do it uh, multiple times. Or after uh, after a few attempts, it will ask you to upgrade to the pro version. Okay. So what I use, I use Canva. Canva is not just a resume builder. It's a very powerful tool that let you do a lot of things, not just resume. So you can simply log into the Canva, and I'm already logged in. Let's go to the home section and i will show you my resume so this one i i found this in canva.com this template but this is no more the same template it is completely customized i have completely shuffled and changed it so yeah it is no more the same template but it has so much flexibility it's so easy to edit the resume over here okay so there are some details about me and my summary and my work experience and on the right side i have i have two column resume okay education tech stack one more thing I forgot to show you. So here you can simply go to this readability section and it shows you a hundred percent perfect ATS resume. You can simply click on it. And this is what a hundred percent friendly ATS looks like plain, straightforward, nothing much fancy. So I, I would move to this resume. Okay. So going forward, my resume will also look like this. I will not keep it fancy anymore like that. Okay. So yeah, I'm planning to do that. Okay, here I'm again. Thank you so much for watching me and supporting me till now. And if you have some doubt, if you want to learn something, let me know in the comment section. You can find my LinkedIn ID in the description of this video. You can connect with me directly. You can ask whatever you want. Thank you for watching me. Happy coding. Bye-bye.